Welcome everyone to Jonas with just commentary. <laughs> Gonna react, <coughs> sorry, to a video that you guys requested. Um, thank you for requesting, guys. Please subscribe and like and share these videos if you want me to react. Please leave a comment below, okay? Thank you so very much. Let's go ahead. Isn't the audio not working or something? Oh, was near them. Oh. Says a group of four with the unique Thai instruments. The one spinning under the chin, the one like this, and of course the guitar with the unique shape. And the other guy looked like he have a basic bass guitar. Wow. That is so cool. <laughs> That is so cool! I like to see the one like that. And they're blowing three times good. Oh. <laughs> wow. Amazing. <laughs> Is this bass like a bass specifically for Thailand? It, look, it sounds like a basic guitar, but maybe it's created and limited to Thailand, this bass guitar. Wow. Doom, doom, doom. Sorry, sorry. เนี่ยเซปองพี่น้องมินี่กลุ่มบุกเข้าคุณเล่นศิลปินใส่ศิลปะวงมากฮะนะครับวงมากฮะคือวงมากโฮมกันโดยบริษัทนัดหมายเน
Wow. What? That was a good one. <laughs> I enjoyed the video a lot. This unique Thai instrument. I keep calling them unique because we've never seen this. Or at least I've never seen this in the Western world. Um, but it is very awesome. Thank you for requesting this video. Of course, guys, please, if you like me to react, leave a comment below. Subscribe, share, okay? Bye, guys. This is Dominica. A small Caribbean island known for its tropical rainforests, volcanic mountains, and picturesque waterfalls. It is so pristine and green that many call it the nature island. Dominica attracts those who enjoy spectacular hiking, adventure, snorkeling and diving, or simply want to harmonize with nature away from their busy lives. But the Dominica we knew changed in September 2017. Hurricane Maria scored a direct hit on us. Lives were lost, the greenery was gone. Raging waters and catastrophic landslides changed the landscape and destroyed the infrastructure. Once again, Dominica made world news. This time though, not as a stunningly beautiful ecotourism destination, but as a disaster zone. But hey, guess what? We are fixing our lives and the island is started to heal. Our nature guides can see it best. When I saw the river after Maria, I said, oh God, we might never able to make a trip again on the river. But after we started cleaning it up, I saw a different kind of beauty. The nature started healing up itself. The leaves started to come back on the trees. The bird is coming. The wildlife are there. It looked different, but it's beautiful. I say, well, we are good to go. Indeed, changes are all around us. If you want to witness them, hiking is the best way. Although, hiking in Dominica can sometimes get uh, a little wet. I'm a canyoning guide in Dominica who knows all the cool locations on this island. Although we got hit by a major hurricane, this island is still amazing. And right now we are rediscovering everything all over again. The forest is changing and looks like a green fantasy world full of tall columns, windows and alleys. It's a joy to walk through this magical land discovering the new redesigned the island offers plenty of opportunities for true enjoyment and adventure. Visitors are coming to hike new landscapes. Others come to help restore our island-long Waitikubudi Trail. We welcome them all, promising a memorable experience. But all these nature changes are happening quickly. A new balance sets in our forests. Parrots find new roosting grounds. Rivers settle in green again valleys. To witness these unique changes, the time to come is now. It may well be a lifetime opportunity to see a nature island being reborn. Yeah man, come with us and you will enjoy it. Be a part of it and it will become a part of you.